what up everybody welcome back to the channel i know i've been a little bit missing just been busy with stuff so damn what am i what's the today's episode well the other day i was driving to go out somewhere and i raised my car to go to helen and like ever since i raised it i've just been so lazy like i drive it i know it's not gonna rub anywhere and i was going into like a like a parking lot and it looked like oh it doesn't look that steep i don't need to hit at an angle and guess what i smoked the front yeah yeah so it's gone so went ahead and uh ordered a whole new setup I'll actually be showing you what i ordered um but i've been ordering a whole bunch of stuff so i can go ahead and do the suspension on the vehicle like everything like refresh everything subframe control arms front control arms power steering rack we're gonna do everything over um, I actually got Kev coming over here right now. He's gonna come pick up the stuff so we can go do it at his shop because it's kind of hard to do at my house. And I just don't want to start something and then I gotta finish, like, I can't finish it. So we're gonna go head over to his shop right now with all the stuff and then go over there. But yeah, here's the car, looks great. Um, <clears throat> so I just want to get this lip on because I've been driving like this for like two weeks and I'm like, damn, this shit looks so ugly and my oem lip was like smoked like look at that bro yeah i'm still missing this because turner motorsports they fucked me and uh never sent me that uh scoop so even though i still order from them but they uh never sent me the right scoop but yeah we're gonna go ahead and uh get everything installed today you're gonna see what splitter what splitter uh, what front lip I'm going to be running. I've been so lazy and whatever. I just finally pulled the trigger because we got a little meet coming up, which is tomorrow, which is a selective search meet. It's like something I put down here in Miami. It's like a, it's like a, like a group of uh, people down here that just like really enjoy quality stuff. Like, you know, they love quality builds and real wheels and just a real a bunch of real stuff. Kev's pulling it right now. So... Yeah, we're going to go ahead and do the install, I'll show you what we got, and then we'll go from there. Yeah, so like I was saying, guys, so yeah, we're going to head over to Kev's shop. We're going to hopefully be able to knock this out in one night. Because you know when you always want to do something and it always never goes the way you want it to do? It just always happens. So you think it's going to go one way, and then it just never goes that way. But let's just pray that it does. But, uh, yeah. Uh, you know what's so funny is that, like, damn, I'm usually like to work on my car at like my own house so like the problem is that since i ever did this interior this shit is really hard to maintain like you can't get in your car dirty you can't go to your gym you can't go to the gym in your car because you're sweating you gotta have towels in your car it, it, it's a lot so the funny fact is that since i'm going to kevin's i'm most likely going to be on the ground when we do the lift i gotta bring extra clothes because i'm not getting back in my car after I'm freaking smoked from being on the ground, like, I'm not gonna be able to jump into my car. I'll stay in the seats and stuff. So, like, I have to bring extra clothes, man. This is, oh man, I gotta stop driving this car. We need, we need another car on the channel. We need another car on the channel. Shout out to Fraga, because he gave me the riveting tool. I don't know if you guys know who Fraga is, so I'll put him right here. King Troll. I'm gonna put my face on a Home Depot poster. Yeah, this is not a construction site, guy. Yeah, give the hard hat at. You got fucking Tim Allen over here. That guy. Yeah, so shout out to him because he gave us the tool that we needed to complete this whole job. So let's hopefully everything goes smooth. But uh, like I was saying, tomorrow is a meet that we're putting together. It's called Selective Search. I'm going to actually drop the Instagram right here. Uh, if you're in South Florida area and like you know you're into the same type of bills that I that you see that's on the channel and stuff, like follow the page, ask to join the WhatsApp chat, and then we usually do like a monthly or just like a pop up meet when like when we go for like a cruise and stuff, and you can see everything there. And it's just like good people around, man. Like we share like the same type of passion that we do. Um, but yeah, all right. So I'll update you when we're at the shop. All right, so I ordered the Turner GT with a splitter and diffuser. Let's see what this shit looks like. Hopefully they said everything, because I'm missing a box. Uh, 
That's what I'm saying. That's why. This monster is way too loud. Like, and I don't hear anything in there. God damn it, bro. They fucked me. I don't think it's in there, bro. I don't. I don't hear anything in there. Unless they taped it really good. They might be taped. Just give them the benefit of the doubt. I don't think they put it in there. Yeah, hopefully they fucking. Uh, I don't think so. Oh wait. Okay. No. No. <laughs> Nothing. God damn it. Really? No, this is the lid itself. Man, this shit feels yo. Good quality as fuck. For real? Those lips are damn it, they can't put this shit on. It's not under there? That's living on the chicken. I'm checking everything. No, man, there's nothing no, in there. Is that double sized tape? Yeah. We're putting hardware on that shit too. Uh, we can put that on. We can rivet that on. Yeah. Like on my car, or I use fucking big ass bolts. Damn. Fuck, I wanna put this shit on so bad. Yeah, so then here. So yeah, they finally sent it. So let's go back to Cavs and get this installed. Uh, man, I'll tell you man, these guys they never never wanna ship stuff on time. Like dude, they have one job. Uh, just don't even look at that guys, I'm sorry, that's like my other life that I have. Ugh. All right, so we're back at Kev's. Hopefully they sent us everything now. Oh, sorry, that's it. Yeah, fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not sponsored. <laughs> oh, I think these are the new hardware. I don't even know if they have clips or not. Oh, these are the arms that we ordered. Oh, that's what they're gonna Oh, these are our camera arms. Oh, they, no. Oh, no, mounting brackets. This is. This is not brackets right. are hardware. Yeah. This is gonna stay. Yeah, this is not. Leave that there. Alright. Brackets. That's the thing that we gotta drill into the frame. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So nice. Let's see. This one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we got all the stuff laid out for all the hardware. I mean, we already installed this part of the lip because like I wasn't gonna go with half a lip to the meet that we went to. So Kevin installed this part for me, but we're gonna finish it off. But we kind of like rigged it in a way. Well, we didn't rig it, it's put on right. But we didn't use like the clips on these bumpers. They're like really weird. Like they sit at an angle and they're like, it's work, it's on. I did like 130, but it hasn't gone off, so. <laughs> it's hot. It ain't going anywhere. So we're gonna finish the other part. So we're gonna take off the bumper and then go from there. Is it nine? No. I was gonna get it. I'll get it from Napa. Or there's nine. They sell paint in Napa. No. Honestly, your best best. To, uh, can we my drill bit set? The blue one to see if I have the drill bit. These all the same. Fucking. So wait, what are these for then? So I'm trying to figure out, so I'm trying to lay everything out. Maybe it's a lot extra. And then these four. Oh, and this is probably to go into the actual uh bracket yes these right? are the four yeah for the bracket this right? used to look four for here yeah and then the other four for yeah. here all right Perfect. cool at least we know where those go to all right cool we'll go there oh what the fuck you
Yeah, right? Alright, see, there's one. Should so we make it a little bit bigger and paint the outside? Then that's weird is the. Because the holes are square. Yeah, yeah, they make it rounded. Yeah. But yeah, but there's that one. Perfect. Next one. Can you just hold that in? Oh, okay, my bad. I'm already recording. the holes to put this uh plate. god damn we're gonna edit uh. that out <laughs> <laughs> uh. wait you want to you want to make sure it's that one before you do it no, we'll too late now. yeah look your, your skid plate the one you installed you could see the the washers used before the oem ones oh i'll see how So all the fasteners are in on the bumper now. Wait, wait, wait. Wow. Let me tell you, that lip was probably very hard to put on with the after effect of putting this whole front lip with splitter and <clears throat> and, the, and diffuser and all, I mean, sorry, with a skip plate and diffuser lit, but Bro, the instructions on Turner Motorsports suck. So, we extended out the whole diffuser out. It looks great. Uh, I really like it. Everything is looking good. I wish I could have had this on when we went to the meet the other day. We fixed the front ride height of the car, too, as well. Got it pretty dialed in. Look at it right here. Looks great. I did end up putting a bit different spring in the rear now, so I got to dial in the rear, but it drives like so much better now. But we got to dial it in so everything is perfect. Oh, I'm sorry. Let me take a step back. Car looks really good, guys. It's getting there. So I just need to do, show you one more from the front. front of it on its extended looks great. 